Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the Windows 10 mail error code you might be receiving. And it would be the 0x8505041 error in particular. So in this brief tutorial I'm going to be showing you guys a quick walkthrough of how to hopefully resolve it. So what we're going to do to begin would be to head over and open up the start menu. And now you want to type in PowerShell, should be one word. Best match that comes up should say Windows PowerShell. You want to right click on it. And then you want to proceed to left click on Run as Administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you want to select Yes. Now I'm going to have a command in the description of this video and I want you to paste it into this Windows PowerShell window. In order to paste it into this window, all you have to do is just go up to the top of this window or screen and you want to right click on it and then left click on the edit button and then left click on paste. And once it's pasted in, hit enter. It'll take a second to run, so just be patient. You can see that it has finished running, so we're going to close out of the Windows PowerShell window. Go to the Start menu, type in App, or you can also type in Store. So Store, Trusted Windows Store App. You want to open it up at this point. And now up at the search bar at the top right, you want to type in Mail and Calendar should be listed as app. You can just left click to open that up. And you want to just left click on get right here and it should begin downloading the mail and calendar app. So pretty straightforward, just click on that, begin installing it and you should be good to go. So I should also note if it does not work for you right away, I'd recommend restarting your computer and then go back into the store as well and then try and click get again. So you might have to restart your computer in between. But I do hope this tutorial was able to help you guys out, and as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.